y volver, volver. Hit it. Volver. <laughs> Hi there, I'm H of the Stage, vocal coach and musician, and thank for joining us here. I hope you had a safe trip, and you know, right? Well. Anyway, today I'm listening, analyzing, reacting for the first time uh, to Vincente Fernandez singing a song Volver Volver. Before we get into it, I want to see the translation of the song so I know what I'm listening to. So let's check it out. So this is the translation that I found. The passionate love is completely exhilarated for going back. I'm on my way to madness. And even if everything tortures me, I know how to love. We parted some time ago, but my moment to lose has come. You were very right. I listened to my heart. And I'm dying for going back. And I'm going back, going back, going back <laughs> to your arms once more. I'll get to your whereabouts. I know how to lose. I know how to lose. I want to go back, go back, go back. So, you know, I'm guessing this is pretty much a literary, you know, translation word for word. But let's continue. We parted some time ago, but my moment to lose has come. You are very right. I listened to my heart. I am dying for going back. I'm going back, going back, going back to your arms once more. I'll get to your whereabouts. Whereabouts just sounds so <laughs> not poetic in the song to me, but okay. I know how to lose. I know how to lose. I want to go back, go back, go back. Anyway, I really hope that this song sounds better in uh, Spanish than it does in English. I'm pretty sure it does, but let's go check it out together. I love this sound. The trumpets. The sound of Mexico. I want to hear this every day. Este amor apasionado anda todo alborotado por volver. Voy camino a la locura y aunque todo me tortura, wow. Amazing. Hit it. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry for pausing it in, in the middle of the chorus. I hate it when I do this. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but I have to go back. I have to listen to the beginning once more. Ooh, uh, let me just tell you what I've heard. His voice kind of has this two, the first thing that I've realized, has these two kind of different uh, qualities of um, uh, resonating. The first one is very breathy, very backwards. It, it sounds, it almost sounds like a, I want to say a falsetto, but it's a very soft rounded vocal and it's a very upwards position listen and you will hear what, what i mean it's kind of wide it sounds something like very soft very whew, just beautiful sulky you know Este amor apasionado Very wide And then he has this kind of gritty a bit more Just almost aggressive Listen Wide Then frontal And he's switching between those two very quickly Again, very wide and backwards Upwards Frontal And just going like this and that's basically all I'm hearing in this beginning. Like his voice going very frontal, then going backwards, then frontal backwards. And he's just switching so effortlessly. It sounds like very blended. Perfect. I mean, this is something that you don't hear in any other kind of music, basically. So that's why I really enjoy listening to music all around the world. But mariachis and Mexican music, I mean, whoo, I just love that sound. Okay, let's finally get to the chorus. Sorry. <laughs> Hit it. 
Look at that belt. <laughs> I love this. Man, this passion, this thing. <laughs> nice, nice. Like, that's probably the best kind of chest voice, I think, that I've heard. I mean, in, in terms of Mexican music, it's kind of hard to talk about these uh, registers that we use in popular Western music because it's kind of different. I mean, I don't know too much about Mexican music, but when it comes to the vocal registers, you have like chest voice, mixed voice, head voice, and fry in the whistle register, you know? But in Mexican music, it's kind of all more blended. You don't really hear the switch between those registers clearly as you do in pop music, you know? It's kind of more up there, and even this what I would say, a belt that's kind of chesty, it could very well be a mixed voice. It really has the strength of the chest voice, but he's smiling while he's singing, and it's just upward, it's really hard to determine. I don't want to say that it's this or that, because I might be wrong, but either way, it sounds killer, you know? But this is a, <laughs> but this is a Mexican falsetto. I'm just waiting for a riba <laughs> or something like that. That's a definitely a falsetto laughter. And sorry, my voice is so sore today. I mean, I can barely talk. <laughs> That's amazing. I bet that kind of falsetto glissando that he does is something that you hear in weddings in these kind of ceremonies. Again, why? Great. It's basically like he's crying while he's singing, you know? He's telling us a story, but he's so inside of him. I mean, you don't have to be a music nerd like I am to enjoy these things this much. Look at his face. Look at his posture. He's completely inside the song. He's basically, you know, he's just singing it almost like at his dying breath because it's so passionate. That's the only way that he can um, deliver this kind of line, you know, not only vocally, but in an interpretation way as well. And it's just wonderful. <laughs> Very soft in this vibrato. And taking his sombrero off. <laughs> That's definitely a belt. I would say that's chest. This is chess for sure. Woo! I mean... Ah... Uh, I have to listen to more Mexican music, like, you know? I don't know what it is about it, but mariachi, that sound, like trumpets, guitars, and this kind of singing. This kind of singing is very... It's very raw, and it's really... I feel like singers that sing this kind of style often sing with their whole body, you know? I just feel like they're so invested in the song, always. Uh, you know, at least the singers that I've listened to on this channel. They just feel so connected with the music. And that's what I really enjoy when I'm listening to anybody. I love when they can take me on a ride, when they can show me a world that I don't know, and when they can just make me forget about every single problem that I had today. And honestly, I had a, I had a lot of them today. I even lost my voice because I was so angry about something. And, you know, I was even wondering if I, if I should even record the video today. You know, it, I just wasn't in my best place. But this music just completely changed my emotion. It just made me feel happy. And that, that's the power of music, right? Good music anyways. Wow. Vincente Fernandez. I'm going to remember that name. Wow, this guy is incredible. Let me know if I should check out more songs from him. And also, if you want to suggest songs that I should check out, please consider becoming a part of my Patreon page because 
that way you support the channel and that's the place where we get to communicate more directly. Also, you get to see these videos for anybody else and you also get some amazing perks. Check it out if that sounds interesting to you. And what can I say? You sticking out till the end really means a lot to me. Consider subscribing, liking this video, sharing it with your friends and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.